on this path. Please, help me look, Inquisitor. Just a little longer. This is a surprise. So this is all some kind of family reunion. <laughs> Mother, daughter, grandson. It rather warms the heart, does it not? Kirin is not your grandson. Let him go. As if I were holding the boy hostage. She's always been ungrateful, you see. Ungrateful! I know how you plan to extend your life, wicked crone. You will not have me, and you will not have my son! Oh, be a good lad and restrain her. What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't know. Of course you know. You drank from the well, did you not? You, Armathal. You are. It's very nice to finally meet you. You see, girl, those are manners, as you require a demonstration. I require nothing from you but your death. You tried that once already, and see how far it got you. I'm sorry, Mother. I heard her calling to me. She said now was the time. I do not understand. Once I was but a woman, crying out in the lonely darkness for justice. And she came to me, a wisp of an ancient being, and she granted me all I wanted and more. I have carried Mythal through the ages ever since, seeking the justice denied to her. Then you carry Mythal inside you? She is a part of me. No more separate than your heart from your chest. What do the voices tell you? They say you speak the truth. But what was Mythal? A legend given name and called a god? Or something more? Truth is not the end, but a beginning. A herald indeed. Shouting to the heavens, harbinger of a new age. As for me, I have had many names. 
names, but you may call me Flemeth. If Mithal is within you, why not reveal yourself? And to whom should I reveal myself? To the elves, to everyone. <laughs> I knew the hearts of men even before Mithal came to me. It is why she came to me. They do not want the truth, and I, I am but a shadow lingering in the sun. Why did Mithal come to you? For a reckoning that will shake the very heavens. And you follow her whims. Do you even know what she truly is? You seek to preserve the powers that were, but to what end? It is because I taught you, girl. Because things happened that were never meant to happen. She was betrayed as I was betrayed, as the world was betrayed. Mithal clawed and crawled her way through the ages to me, and I will see her avenged. Alas, so long as the music plays, we dance. I know the name Flemeth. It belongs to an ancient Ferelden legend. It says long ago you left your husband for a lover. Your husband then tricked you, killed your lover, and imprisoned you. Then a spirit came to offer you vengeance. Mithar, that's what you spoke of. One day someone will summarize the terrible events of your life so quickly. But yes, I was that woman. That is how my tale began. Flemeth appears in other legends helping heroes for reasons of her own. I nudge history when it's required. Other times, a shove is needed. <laughs> I presume you know what we're up against. Better than you could possibly imagine. So will you help us? Once I have what I came for. No, I will not allow it. He carries a piece of what once was, snatched from the jaws of darkness. You know this. He is not your pawn, Mother. I will not let you use him. Have you not used him? Was that not your purpose, the reason you agreed to his creation? That was them. Now he... He is my son. Lemeth extends her life by possessing the bodies of her daughters, Inquisitor. That was the fate she intended for me. I thwarted her, and now she intends to have Kieran instead. Wait, the way she talked about Kieran. I am not the only one carrying the soul of a being long thought lost. He is more than that, Mother. As am I. Yet do you hear me complain? Our destinies are not so easily avoided, dear girl. Allah, uh, I have to. You do not belong to her, Kieran. Neither of us do. If Kieran is so special, why did you wait until now to come for him? I did not know where he was. Morrigan cleverly hid him from me. Until now. <gasps> Twas the well. Be thankful you did not drink. Imagine, bound to your dear mother for eternity. <laughs> Whatever else you think he is, Kieran is still a child. And so much better behaved than his mother was at his age. Kieran, I... As you wish. Hear my proposal, dear girl. Let me take the land, and you are free of me forever. I will never interfere with or harm you again. Or keep the lad with you, and you will never be safe from me. I will have my due. He returns with me. Decided so quickly. Do whatever you wish. Take over my body now if you must, but Kieran will be free of your clutches. I am many things, but I will not be the mother you were to me.
No more dreams? No more dreams. A soul is not forced upon the unwilling, Morrigan. You were never in danger from me. As for you, Inquisitor, there is an ancient altar deep within a shaded wood. Go to it. Summon the dragon that is its guardian. Master it in combat, and it is yours to command against Corypheus. Fail and die. Wait! Are you all right, Kieran? You are not hurt. I feel lonely. She wanted the old god soul all along. Is it worth reminding myself that perhaps I do not know everything after all? My mother has the soul of an elven goddess, or whatever Mithal truly was, and her plans are unknown to me. So Kieran had the soul of an old god? Taken from the Archdemon at the final battle of the Fifth Blight. Yes, he has never known anything else. I'm uncertain what effect this will have on him. But why did you...? I told you at the temple, the magic of old must be preserved. No matter how feared. Kieran had a destiny, and now... it is in Flemeth's hands. I suppose we shall see what she does with it. You truly had no idea what she was. I knew she kept the truth from me. I even suspected she was not truly human, but... This... I always thought the so-called elven gods were little more than glorified rulers, but now... I have doubt. And doubt is... an uncomfortable thing, Inquisitor. I suppose I should be thankful you drank from the well. Eternal servitude to mother would not be my first choice. For what it's worth, I think you did the right thing. Did I? She was testing me. And I cannot tell whether I passed. Mother said... You must summon a dragon at an ancient altar. Do you know where that is? I think so. It's a place dedicated to Mithar. As, no doubt, is the guardian you must battle. Pray my mother has not led you astray, Inquisitor. She is not above doing so for her own amusement. <laughs> 